When I was 11 years old, I went on a school field trip to learn how maple syrup is made. Where I expected to find a fun afternoon, I found something else entirely. I found a passion for making maple syrup. <laughs> um, I was pretty bored and I was just kind of at home when I was 11, 12, 10 years old. And um, in the spring, it just it was just kind of a, a time when it's really gloomy, kind of depressing almost. And so maple filled that gap for me. It filled the gap between hockey season and summer. And so I was able to really pursue this and have fun with it and really enjoy myself in that time when before there was nothing to do. I think that the most rewarding thing about Parker Maple is the fact that we can make a difference in people's lives because um, you know it started out as a company just making syrup, maple syrup, putting it in a barrel and selling it. But really it's so much more than that. It's, it's an opportunity to be able to create products that are better for you and people can eat and enjoy and not have kind of the consequences of processed sugars. But um, even more than that, it's an opportunity to create wealth and then use that wealth to, to benefit the community, to benefit young entrepreneurs around the world. We're in a very happy place and it's very exciting and um, we're, we're really honing down what the mission of the company is. Helping other young entrepreneurs and helping his hometown where he comes from are two things that we really want to focus on. So wherever we can, giving back and um, we're working on partnering with young entrepreneurship organizations and um, doing stuff like that. So a little bit over a year ago, um, Alessandro and I met at um, a conservative organization um, conference in Washington, D.C. Um, and that progressed into us dating and um, eventually getting married. And so we got married in, in January um, and we decided that rather than starting our lives in New York, we would start our lives in Austin, which is just a, a great environment to have a startup business in. And our production is still in New York, so we kind of our sales and marketing corporate staff is in Austin and then our production staff is in New York. Mark Cuban since Shark Tank has been a great mentor and advisor. Um, it's just it's amazing to be able to have someone like that in your Rolodex to reach out to and to ask questions and, and to really have their support.